Hi, this is my reflection over the ceremonial speech and over the semester as a whole. So my first, we'll be talking about the semester experience. How do you think you have advanced as a public speaker during the semester? I think I have advanced a lot. I think um, I always struggled with public speaking, but I think this class definitely uh, gave me a lot of confidence and gave me a lot of different tools that I could use to become a better speaker. What is the most important concept or theory you've learned from our textbook? Did it apply to your everyday life? Um, I would definitely say that it's the pathos, ethos, and logos uh, theory theories. Uh, basically, just because um, it taught me uh, it taught me how to appeal to my audience. So it gives me three different you know, three different ways of feeling, you know, um, you know, whether I want to pertain to someone's, you know, feelings or anything like that, you know, it's basically, uh, it basically taught me and all the other students how uh, to appeal to the audience. So it definitely applied to my everyday life because, um, you know, even when telling stories, you know, I don't want to tell someone a story that they're not going to like, you know, I want to appeal to something that they would be interested in. Uh, now it says, recommend to me, your instructor, what you would start, stop, and continue if you were teaching this course next semester. Well, I think overall, I think this class went very well, and I think my instructor, Ms. Siebert, uh, did a very great job. Um, I'm not really sure uh, what I would stop uh, or start, so I'll start with continue. Uh, continue, I would definitely continue to um, have the due dates, you know, the consistent due dates every week. Um, and then another thing I would continue would be um, giving us, you know, listing out all the assignments at the beginning of the year. Uh, so, and then like, especially stuff for like each speech, you know, before each speech starts. So like before the persuasive speech started, you know, it, it, um, it gave a huge file, a huge document that laid out the outline and the note cards and the you know the final outline and it gave and it and it mentioned all you know what each one how many points each one was worth and it basically just laid out the entire section at once and I thought that was a huge help you know it was nice to go back there and check up on everything uh, so what I would start and what I would stop um, truthfully I really can't think of anything to be honest because I, I thought this class was really well. I thought it was very well organized. All right, now to go talk about my speech. Um, some guideline questions. How did I choose my topic? I chose my topic because I'm a huge Ariana Grande fan, and I saw her concert <clears throat> uh, just about a month and a half ago. And she's uh, I'm a huge fan of her, and I love her music, so I thought I'd pick someone that I was really interested in learning more about. How did I research my topic? I basically just searched online, um, looking up different um, keywords and stuff. Um, I was just kind of trying to find interesting information about her. How did I practice my delivery? I practiced my delivery by running the speech over um, first in my head, you know, reading through it to make sure it, it went fluently, and then practicing <clears throat> um, out loud, just reading it out loud. Did I establish my credibility as a speaker and the credibility of your sources? I think I established the credibility of my sources pretty well um, as a speaker. Um, I thought I was confident, uh, so I think that helped with my credibility. Uh, did I get less or more nervous as the speech progressed? I think at the beginning I was a little nervous, but as it progressed, I think you know each time I give a speech, Progressively, I get more and more nervous because I don't want to be dragging on. I don't want to be adding extra little facts that I don't necessarily need. And how did my audience respond to my speech? I, I hope my audience responded very well. Um, I know it's kind of a weird topic to give, you know, on, I gave it on a, a you know, a woman pop star. But um, I know... A lot of people, a lot of my friends know that I'm a huge Ariana Grande fan, so I don't think they felt too weird. 
what did I do in my speech that worked, what didn't work? I think that um, I gave good quotes. You know, I had a quote in each one. And what didn't work, I would say that my um, my transitions didn't work so well. What areas can I target for improvement? I would definitely say my uh, my I I would definitely target to improve on transitions. And then after the semester, what feels like second nature in terms of organization and delivery? I think just standing tall and being confident in what I'm saying. I think that definitely is, has come second nature to me.